Hey y'all, this will be a quick video about the bash completion package. Bash completion is a simple and extremely useful way to extend the context awareness of your shell's built-in tab completion, and it'll definitely come in handy on the RHCSA as well. You can install bash completion like this, sudo yum install bash completion. And just like that, we'll have it installed. Bash completion installs itself into the etc profile directory, so we can just take a look at it like this. And there it is, bash completion.sh. In new shells, bash completion will start working right away, but if we want it to start in our current shell, we can type in source etc profile, and that'll get it started up. To demonstrate the usefulness, we can use the nmcli command. NMCLI has tons and tons of options as you drill down more and more, so it can be really handy to use bash completion to fill in those gaps. And I mean, check this out, we have 296 possible options for this command. So no one's expected to memorize all of these, so it's just really useful that it can fill everything in for you. Now, in most cases, bash completion is really handy, but other times it can just be straight up annoying and really slow. So if you ever need to, Here's how to unload it. Just type in shop-u prog comp. And this should unload bash completion. So now if I go back to nmcli, all I see are files and directories. If you ever want to reload bash completion, just type in shop-s prog comp. And that should bring it right back. There we go. So that'll be all for this video. I hope it was useful. Thanks.